Hey guys, it's been a while since I've made a video. This is my couponing from over the weekend. Um, it's been really crazy, but maybe I'll talk about that a little bit. Um, but I did Fred Meyer, Walmart, some Target, and then a little bit of Winco at the end. So I'm just going to try to squeeze it all into one video. It'll probably be a long video, but easier than making a bunch of videos tonight. Um, might notice my penguins in the background. Oh, that's the only clean blanket I could find because the dogs decided to ruin the other blanket I usually use as the backdrop. But penguins are me and my husband's love animal, so I have like penguin everything. But anyway, it's been a crazy week. Um, not going to go into too much detail about my crazy, crazy week, but I started a new job, so I now work five days a week doing daycare, and then two days um, on weekends I am a server, and I just started training on that, and I really like it, but it'll probably get better as I get to know people and um, their orders and stuff like that. So right now, like, everybody knows everyone there, but I do not know anyone's names. Um, but then also last Wednesday we went and picked up the kids and, um, we were sitting at a stoplight and we got rear-ended. So that was crazy. It wasn't, like, it was a shock to all of us, but, and it, we got a little bit of whiplash. The kids are fine. Um, my husband probably caught the worst of it with whiplash. I got a headache and whiplash, but I'm better now. But now we're dealing with insurance companies and all of that. And today we went and got a rental. And so that was like a little money out of pocket because we had a refundable deposit we had to put down on that. But that's paid for, going to be paid for by their insurance. Um, and our car is in the shop. So I don't know what's going to happen with that. But it's been crazy it's been like thing after thing after thing lately so yeah but we're gonna get into the deals um I saw that I hit 300 subscribers so that is amazing and so I'm gonna do a giveaway at the very end so stick around for that um yeah with the deals we'll start with Fred Meyer I went there tonight and um, right now there's a buy six, save three dollar sale going on. So a lot of these are that. So the American Beauty Pasta, this is like the regular kind. Those are 49 cents each after the buy six, save three. Um, and then you get 50 cents back on Ibotta. Um, this one's wrong. That's not a limit of five. It's the other one that's a limit of five. Um, this one is... Um, you buy two, you get a dollar back. So the thick and hearty is the same deal, but it's a different rebate and they're 49 cents and you get 50 cents back. And that's a limit of five on those ones. So two of the regular ones and you can get five of the thick and hearty kind. So I just picked up two and two though, to keep it with my, um, buy six save three um i also decided to get the back to nature crackers i got the crispy cheddar crackers which i think are like cheese it's and i got the classic rounds which are basically ritz so we'll see what they taste like these are in like the the i think they call it market nature market section I don't know, like the healthy section of the store. Um, so those are $1.99 after the buy six, save $3, and you get a dollar back on a bottom, making those 99 cents. But someone had said that there was gonna be a Catalina, I'm not sure where that beeping is coming from, but um, someone said that there was gonna be a Catalina if you bought two, that didn't print for me. I don't know if it's only at Kroger's or if it hasn't started or if it ended or what, but it did not work for me. I decided to try 
the cookies and see if it would print on that. So I got those, these um, fudge mint cookies. Those are $2.49. And uh, after the buy six, save three, you get a dollar back on Ibotta, making them $1.49 each. I didn't know if that also counted, but it didn't print anything on that either. But it would have, if it does print for you, or it would be 49 cents each for those, and um, the other ones would have been free. So I did want to try those deals, but it did not work out. But a dollar a box for crackers and a dollar fifty for cookies isn't terrible, so you could do that deal anyway if you wanted to. Then I also grabbed the Purina Alpo T bones. These are a dollar each on sale, ten for ten. There's a dollar fifty off two. Um, gosh, that beeping is annoying me so much. I don't even know if you guys can hear it, but um, they're a dollar fifty off two, and so it makes them twenty five cents each. There is coupon on coupons.com, and there's also digital. So I picked up three or six and used three coupons. I used a digital and then two paper coupons. I also got this. This was the freebie from like two weeks ago, so I got the coconut chocolate. Anyway, figured out what the beeping was. Um, so I also got these Chef's Cut. Um, I'm going to make my husband eat jerky and a like, like these beef stick. Um, kind of like I made the chocolate bouquet. I'm going to make like a meat bouquet for Easter, and I'm going to leave it for him um, before I go to work on Sunday. So I'm going to give him like a bunch of different kinds to try, but it's kind of like a keto bouquet. We haven't been doing keto lately because life has just been so stressful, but for when he goes back on keto, I want to make it for him, and I'm going to give it to him for Easter since that was the plan before we decided to cheat all week, but... These I saw on Ohio Valley, Valley Couponer, and um, yeah, like the day I was going to go out and get it, it was like the day that it expired and I didn't make it out that night, so then they changed the rebate, so they're $1.25 on sale and there's a $0.75 cent I bought it. Makes them $0.50 cents each, which I think is an okay deal for these. I'm going to get a bunch of them anyway, so I might as well get them on a good sale. But one of these ring up for $1.79 instead of $1.25, but the guy at self-checkout manually changed it for me, so I don't know why one of them. It was this beef and pork stick that didn't work in its original smokehouse, so maybe it wasn't supposed to be in with those. I'm really not sure. Um, but I also got the jalapeno cheddar, and I got two of these barbecue flavors, because my and it's a chicken one. My husband likes barbecue stuff, and I got a pepperoni flavor, so, and that's a turkey one. There's chicken, turkey, pork and beef, and beef and pork. That's funny. Like that. Pork and beef, and beef and pork. <laughs> but anyways, those are 50 cents each. I'm probably going to go do that deal a couple times as resets, so I can make it huge bouquet for him this weekend. Um, I also picked up mac and cheese. I need some other things, so I got one of the unicorn shapes ones, and I got three of the Paw Patrol, because they had a bunch of Paw Patrol, but they only had one of the unicorn left. But it's a really good deal, so people have been picking it up. But the mac and cheese shapes are 50 cents after the buy six, save three. I had a dollar off for tear pad coupon that I found. So I made those 25 cents a box, which I think is awesome. And then I also did the fun size candy. Those are a dollar. There's a dollar off one coupon that's digital, and there's also one on coupons.com. So it makes those free. If you go to Walmart, you could get a little bit of overage, I think. Um, yeah, Fred Meyer's closer, so I, and I was going there, so I picked them up there. But I got the crunch, and that coupon doesn't have a restriction. At least when I printed it, it doesn't. I don't know if they'll change it. They have a butter finger crisp one. 
that I decided to try and see if it worked on that. And it worked just fine. And then I got the Butterfinger regular. So that is all I did at um, Fred Meyer. And I didn't do a total for that. but Then I went to Walmart over the weekend. And I got these Kleenex. This is a it says a three bundle pack right here. And those are 97 cents. I had a dollar coupon. And so that gave me three cents of overage. I got that coupon from this Winco flyer. Um, let's see. This is right here off any one bundle pack of Kleenex facial tissue, but it doesn't have any size restrictions in this three pack says bundle pack. So I decided to try that out. You can use these at Walmart. They are manufacturer coupons, and they don't have any limits. And you can't double them, though. But they're good until 5-5, five, five. but they do say Winco Foods on them. But Walmart does take them because they are a manufacturer coupon. So, if you have a Winco, I'd go look for those coupons. Then I also got the U by Kotex. Those are $0.94. Cents. I had a dollar coupon. That gave me $0.06 cents in overage. And those are also a coupon out of this flyer. It says on any one pack of Uvi Kotex pads, tampons, or liners, and there's no size restrictions on that. So you could even grab them at Winco if you have a Winco, because they're $1.18 there. So there's six cents overage at Walmart though, so better deal there. Then I found the coffee latte um, Fordo Energy Coffee. These are like, really big compared to those little coffee shots. This is like an actual coffee drink and you can pull this off and open it. Those are $2.50 plus we have a 10 cent deposit and you get $2.50 back on I bought them making them 10 cents but you get the 10 cent deposit back but if you don't have a deposit then it's just free. I also grabbed and these were by like the Starbucks coffee drinks. They're not in the coffee section. They're like buy the ready to go um, Starbucks coffees in your store. At least in my store, that's where they are. And then I got the Chomps. These are $1.98, you get $1.98 back on Ibotta, so it makes them free. So I grabbed this for my husband's um, Easter bouquet. And those are like in the gluten-free section where we got like the Char products and stuff. That's where those are, on like a bottom shelf, in case you couldn't find them. Um, also picked up two of the Zyrtec. Um, this is when those coupons hadn't expired yet. There is a new printable on coupons.com, but the insert coupon has expired. So I picked up two when the insert coupon was still good. And they're $3.47 minus $4 coupon. Gives you $0.53 cents in overage. You can submit to Ibotta for $2. It doesn't pick this up, but I've just been putting in tickets and they've been crediting me for that. So I would try that. And so for all of that, my total came to $3.13 and I got back $8.48 on Ibotta, making it a $5.35 moneymaker for these products right here, which is amazing. And then I went to Target. I picked up this tissue paper art kit. It's a one count. It's in the dollar spot. It was a dollar, but my brother had given me a gift card with $0.95 cents on it, so I used it on this. I made it five cents for that for me. And I did the razor deal. I'm waiting for some more razors. For some reason, I accidentally grabbed four packages of razors um, when I meant to grab three. So I'm going, when I get my other coupons, I'm going to take my receipt back and get my $4 back. And one of them will be, have been $1.99. But for the deal, you want to grab three. Makes it $5.99 um, times three is $17.97. Use a $7 off two coupon and a $3 off one cartwheel. You're gonna pay $7.97, get back a $5 gift card, plus submit $6 to Ibotta, making it a $3.03 money maker, which is amazing. But it could be a $4.03 um, money maker if you have that $4 coupon. You could use the seven off two and the $4 coupon instead of the $3 cartwheel. And, or you could even use two $4 ones and a $3 one. I don't know. I'm not going to do the math right now. My head gets, um, 
whichever way makes it a better deal. Last week, these ones were scanning. These bonus packs were scanning on Ibotta. This week, they're not. And so I grabbed three of these. And that's why I think I accidentally grabbed this extra one. Because I had it in my cart. And then I scanned it on Ibotta. You should be able to put it in a ticket. If um, it doesn't scan for this one. Like if you want to grab these ones and put in a ticket and wait for it. They should give you the money because those should qualify. But I didn't want to do that. I wanted them to scan and work. So that's why I picked up those ones. Um, let's see. I also did the suave deal. Um, these big bottles right here. These big bottles right here of shampoo and conditioner are $2.89. You want to buy four, it comes to $11.56. When you buy four, you get a $5 gift card. Use two of those $3 off two coupons. You're going to pay $5.56 and get a $5 gift card, making it $0.56 cents for four, or $0.14 cents each, which is amazing. Then I also got some random ones. I don't know if this one was not working, but she had to like manually um, tell the computer which one it, um, the coupon was for. So I think these ones were working just fine, but that one might not have since it's a new look one. But those are $2.99. You're going to buy four. It comes to $11.96. Um, it comes to $11.96. Then you use two of those $3 off two coupons from Pest Insert. You pay $5.96, you get a $5 gift card. Makes it $0.96 cents for four or $0.24 cents each, which is still an amazing deal. Then, just for fun, I submitted it to Fetch. I didn't even realize it would work for these. But there's a spend 10, get 15 hundred points and then for the stylers you get 17 points and for the shampoo and conditioner you get 16 points so I got back 1635 points which is equivalent to a dollar 64 so it actually made those a money maker and I thought I had a total oh, I think this was it so for all of that if you get all that it should be twenty dollars and forty nine cents you get back fifteen dollars in gift cards six dollars on Ibotta and a dollar sixty-four on fetch, making it a two dollar and fifteen cent money maker for all of that, which is still an amazing deal. After I go back and get my four dollars back for one of those, it's still a money maker, even though I messed up on that. And then lastly, I went to Winco, and because I was already in Winco, I used those coupons. Those are a dollar eighteen on like a rollback sale. It's not rollback, but you know, like a savings at Winco. Um, and there's a dollar coupon. Makes them 18 cents each. Which is still pretty good. Dollar for five. Um, under a dollar for five of those. So I did that. But I want to do a giveaway on these um, coupon papers because you can use them. I guess coupon flyers because they're manufacturer coupons and you should be able to use them after Walmart. Um, so hopefully you can. Maybe I'll throw in some other coupons, just in case. But they let me use them at my Walmart. It should be fine. Anyway, I think I'm going to draw a couple winners for that and do like five of these sheets each. And I'll show you the coupons. They have a dollar off of any one Kleenex, dollar off of Cottonelle, dollar off of this Scott, which I'm kind of tempted to try at Dollar Tree, but I don't know if they do accept it since it has another store's name on it. Um, a dollar off of a package of Scott towels, six pack, two dollars off of Huggies box diapers, a dollar off of You Buy Kotex, two dollars off of Full Ups or Good Nights, and a dollar off of Viva paper towels, six packs or larger. Um, I know Walmart, at least Walmart, should accept them. Um, mine did, but I don't know if any other stores do. I haven't really tried them at any other stores. But yeah, I'm going to give away some of those, and I'll probably throw in some other coupons, but to be entered to that, you just have to be subscribed to my channel, and let me know how your week is going, and also um, maybe like a good thing that happened to your week. I need some good positive things to read and also um, 
what your favorite videos of mine are to watch. Like, what do you come to my channel for? Is it Walmart, Fred Meyer, Ibotta? Let me know. Anyway, bye guys.